Hey, Tracy Lewis from Stuff and Things. I am working today on my new program for my Paper Pumpkin customers. I have so many cards from alternatives. I create six to nine alternatives, it seems, per alternative video. And I do put them in my stash to sell at craft fairs. I do have them on display when I'm teaching classes for people to buy. And then, I, of course, I use them. But I've just got so many that I thought it would be fun to give back to my customers. And this month is the first six-month increment since I in implemented the program in April. It's called the 4P, and that's Paper Pumpkin Perks Program, where every three months I just send a handmade thank you card with a note and maybe a few snippets and samples of the Stampin' Up! regular product line. And then at six months of active status, I will send a sampling of my Paper Pumpkin cards. So when I'm done with Paper Pumpkin, they tend to sit for a few months. This is the last chunk I have to do, where like this was a front and I didn't get it turned into a card. Even if they're turned into a card, like these are the Halloween ones, I'll put a white sheet in here, and then I need to stamp the back. I haven't really decided yet for the beginner card samples. Those are usually the extras, but I might actually go ahead and make these into maybe one step up cards with a couple of simple embellishments and throw those out to my customers as a thank you. And it'll be just a random sampling. I will include envelopes and what they look like when they're all done. I will put them in an envelope that will get four of these. All packaged up. This is what my cards look like when I am selling them. And I will send them a sampling of four. So I'm going to make up three sets after I finish prepping the last chunk of cards. And then I've already counted my collection of cards that I have ready to go and so I don't know if I can show you but this is what it looks like and I have made a little section called 4P cards and this is all that I have prepped there are 48 of them plus I guess another 15 to 20 here to finish off depending on whether I go ahead and work on some of these beginner stamper cards that are usually single color. I'll trim them down, maybe add some twine, add a, a complementary layer, get those all finished up and then I will pick some random sets, get, I need to get, send three this month and then that way I my customers get a reward for their business which I greatly appreciate. Thanks for watching.